Brainy Dose presents 18 Signs You May Have High Functioning Depression Depression doesn't always look the way you think it should. While some people may find it difficult to get out of bed, others with depression can go about their normal daily routine, smiling and taking care of responsibilities. Sometimes called smiling depression, the condition occurs when you appear happy, successful, and accomplished on the outside. But inside, you struggle with sadness, turmoil, and feelings of inadequacy. High-functioning depression is atypical, and some people may be surprised to find out that they are actually experiencing symptoms of depression. So here's what you should know about this often hidden health condition. And the following signs are something you should definitely pay attention to. Number 18. Feeling sad, but not sure why. Everyone deals with bouts of sadness occasionally even for reasons beyond explanation. But if you're generally feeling sad most of the time and aren't really sure why, it could be a sign of high-functioning depression. It may not be enough to keep you in bed or disrupt your daily functioning, but it can make you feel heavy and really wear you down. Number 17. Inability to relax. People with high-functioning depression know that when they stop, even for a moment, the sadness takes over. This is why many of them are always on the go or constantly doing something. If you have high-functioning depression, you're uncomfortable with rest or calmness, and you do whatever it takes to keep your mind occupied. Number 16. Stressing about time. Those who suffer from high-functioning depression are often overachievers who constantly find themselves stressing about time. The time it takes to get something done, time spent on something that may not be worth it, and the time needed to complete an endless list of other tasks. If you're suffering from high-functioning depression, evaluating your time probably doesn't stop with task-oriented things either. You even stress about the time spent on the more joyous things in life, like hobbies or leisure activities. Number 15. Overthinking everything. It doesn't matter if the situation is big or small. People with high-functioning depression tend to overthink everything, this is because of the constant self-doubt these individuals deal with on an everyday basis. If you have high-functioning depression, you often find yourself questioning everything you do. It's an absolutely exhausting cycle of overanalyzing, which can lead to mental and emotional breakdowns. Number 14. Striving for perfection. Much like with an inability to relax and de-stress, people with high-functioning depression find it very hard to settle for mediocre they set their expectations too high, and in an effort to achieve all of their goals, they wear themselves thin and effectively beat themselves down through the process. With high-functioning depression, you often feel like you aren't getting enough done, and as a result, you criticize yourself and your productivity. Number 13. Changes in Sleeping Pattern High-functioning depression also affects sleep. Some of the changes in sleep patterns include difficulty falling asleep, and sleeping too much. If you know before hitting the light switch that you'll struggle to fall asleep, or you get 10 hours every night and still can't stay awake at work, something more serious could be going on. Depression naps are also very real and are harmful in terms of productivity and mental health. Sleeping as an escape from reality can be an unhealthy way of dealing with feelings, becoming a kind of defense mechanism. Number 12, difficulty fully experiencing happiness. Emotions are part of our everyday life, so it's normal to experience sadness and grief from time to time. While people with high-functioning depression do have moments in life when they feel happy, they don't allow themselves to fully experience joy to its fullest extent. If there are hobbies, activities, or goals that have brought you relief and happiness in the past, but eventually they became more of a burden to you than something you find pleasure in, that's a sign that something's off. Also, you may feel desensitized in situations that would typically stir emotion, or inexplicably sad in situations that would otherwise be considered joyful. Number 11. Declining Social Invitations While high-functioning depression may not leave a person devastated and hopeless, it can seriously dent their quality of life, dampen their enthusiasm for work, school, family, and even social activities. A change in social activities can be one of the earliest warning signs. If you have high-functioning depression, you still go to work and interact with people, but outside of work, 
you may stop hanging out with friends and find yourself making up excuses as to why. You may become somewhat isolated, and this often leads to distance in relationships. Number 10. Being extremely impulsive. As I mentioned earlier, a lot of people with high-functioning depression have a difficult time fully experiencing joy. To combat this, many will go to extremes to try and feel or experience any emotion at all. This can be something as simple as getting a tattoo or piercing to feel pain or doing something dangerous and illegal to feel the adrenaline. If you find yourself seeking to sabotage your life with activities and events that are extreme, it's a warning sign of a bigger issue. Number 9. Overdoing everything. When it comes to anything in life, eating, drinking, working, studying, etc., those with high functioning depression don't know what a middle ground is. Instead, they do everything to the extreme and overdo most things in their lives. This, however, can be something that turns into an alarming bad habit, like gambling, drinking, or drug use. Number 8. Sweating the small stuff. Those with high-functioning depression often find that small things that only mildly irritated them before are now hard to deal with. Things that didn't feel so important in the past suddenly become too much to handle, such as not being able to find your keys, a grocery bag breaking, or missing the train. If you're struggling to cope with even the smallest of stressful situations, you may be dealing with high-functioning depression. Number 7. Having Rage Issues Everyone's entitled to a bout of crankiness or the occasional bad mood. But when it comes to emotions and anger, those with high-functioning depression often fly off the handle quicker than others. This is due to suppressed emotions or what experts call bottling things up. If you don't deal with your emotions or underlying problems, when things trigger you, you unleash them all, often at the wrong times. Number 6. Having trouble focusing. High-functioning depression can cause people to suffer from a feeling of brain fog or that fuzzy-headed lack of focus. You may have problems staying focused and engaged during work, at school, at home, or during social activities. For example, you may space out while a friend's telling a story or feel like you can't center your thoughts at work. And while this may be okay if it happens occasionally, if the feeling is ongoing, it's something you should pay attention to. Number 5. Turning to Coping Strategies People with high-functioning depression often turn to coping strategies to take the edge off. If you've become too reliant on coping mechanisms, then you could have a problem. Binge-watching TV shows may seem innocent enough, but if you're doing it every night as a means to escape your life, then it could be a sign that you're dealing with some bigger issues. The same goes for reliance on video games or using substances like drugs and alcohol. Number 4. Constantly questioning the past and future High-functioning depression can cause people to constantly question their decisions and how it will affect their future. These can be things like picking the right school, choosing the right career, dating the right person, etc. If you have high-functioning depression, you often find it hard to shake the worry and you obsess over your decisions day after day. Number 3. Uncomfortable with stability People with high-functioning depression feel uncomfortable when they are in a state of stability. Simply put, they are uncomfortable with things when they are too good. If you are always looking for reasons for things to go wrong, take it as a sign, because ultimately, this can lead to self-sabotaging your own life, relationships, and even career. Number 2. Feeling Misunderstood It's common for people with high-functioning depression to feel misunderstood, because they don't act like the typical depressed person. You tend to function like everyone else, maintaining a house, a job, and seemingly healthy social life. But what's going on internally doesn't match what others see on the outside. Number 1. Having other health issues Underlying medical conditions like diabetes or cancer cause stress and strain that can lead to depression. On the other hand, depression can lower immunity, making you more vulnerable to getting sick. High-functioning depression can also show up physically in the body in the form of aches and pains. You may have aching shoulders, headaches that keep hitting you midday, or a general sense of discomfort that just won't go away. While these symptoms may not be as severe as those of major depression, they still rob you of the ability to be happy and live your life to the fullest. Of course, this list cannot diagnose you with high-functioning depression. Only a trained medical professional can do that. 
but hopefully it gives you a better understanding of what you may be experiencing if you recognize these symptoms. What do you think? Have you ever experienced any of these symptoms? And how did you deal with them? Share your story in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so we can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also, be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.